は100人です今宵 IDF ルールの初戦を飾るのはこの2人かつて IDF の最強外国人と呼ばれた男ジョシュ・バーネットそして2代目人間風車鈴木秀樹エース候補として今上り上司の鈴木ジョッジとの出会いはデビュー前に遡る僕はミルロビーさんにずっと長く座ってたんだってそのやつ見ると人俺の10万円とかよくそれこそ日本の試合がある時に練習に行きたいなんだっていうので半分先生みたいなもん僕はキャッチアウトキャッチキャッチ同じバックボーンを持つ2人が大みそかのリングで対戦プロレスラー的なもので総合格闘技のプロレスラーリングも関係なくやってるっていうのもあの憧れというか尊敬する選手ですね<笑>もちろん勝つ<笑>こうロビンソンのスープレックスみたいなのがまあスープレックスもいいけどやはりそこに始めた時に荒々しさが欲しいなそれが出てくればもうってものはどういうふうに思ってるんですかこの試合を見てもらった後にお客さんがそれぞれ持ってくれる感想がプロレスにただあの勝負するだけっていうんであれば町の中道大会でもいいわけで助手が相手だったら IGF が今やっているプロレスリングっていうのを見せられるかなと思ってます年末大晦日この That Barnett has never seen. Into the ring, Hideki Suzuki. Gilly Robinson, who of course trained Kazushi Sakuraba in the art of catch wrestling. Barnett to the Izu!
move my seat over a little bit, Mike, because Josh Barnett cuts quite an imposing and scary figure as he struts his way to the ring. Barnett, the baby-faced assassin, the war master, a 31 and 5 mixed martial arts record, the former UFC heavyweight champion, the former openweight king of Pancrase, has over 60 matches wrestling here in Japan. A catch wrestler. A black belt in BJJ under Eric Paulson. They love him here in Japan. And you know that Barnett loves wrestling for the Japanese fans. The first of our wrestling fights on tonight's card. Suzuki, the first to emerge from his corner. Barnett peels off his T-shirt and we are ready to get this one on. Final inspection from our center referee. Can Suzuki outstrength Josh Barnett? What has Barnett got in his bag of tricks for Hudeki Suzuki? Barnett actually has the higher experience in pro wrestling than does Suzuki. And look at the stare down there from Barnett. He is ready to go. Suzuki remaining calm, but it's got to unnerve you a little to stare into the eyes here. The shark-like eyes of Josh Barnett. Anything can happen here. Barnett just flexing off the ropes, bouncing around a lot, and here we go. Suzuki rolling somersault to start. Barnett gets out of the way. And Suzuki goes for a low sweep. You've got to be quick. Barnett always been a quick heavyweight. High left round kick from Barnett. Looks for a side kick here, perhaps. No. Shoots down for a single leg Suzuki. Barnett locks up the shoulder early on. Locks up the forearm. Tries to tie up the leg now. Looking for an early submission, Barnett. And Suzuki gives him a slap. No striking with a closed fist, of course. Barnett locking up that right leg. Suzuki into a real narrow position here. Barnett dragging the leg. Suzuki rolls out, takes Barnett's leg. Nice exchanges early on here. Locking up the ankle, Josh Barnett. And Suzuki trying for a submission off that right leg at an awkward angle. Looking to scissor up the neck momentarily, Barnett. The tremendous strength of the former UFC champion. And he looks for a submission on the left. The extension on that Achilles here. Can Suzuki get out of trouble? And he does. Takes the back here of Barnett. He looks for a submission. Looks for a choke. Barnett back in the genuflect position. Now back on both feet. And Barnett drags him down. Still Suzuki though. Controlling the head. Barnett tucking the chin. Pops the head out. Chicken wing behind the back. Nice work here from Barnett. Very slick early on. Posting up on one arm is Suzuki. Just straining the shoulder here. You can see the grimace of pain in the face of Hideki Suzuki. Barnett applies the pressure. And Suzuki kicks out and manages to get to the ropes. Barnett forced to break the move. Holding that shoulder is Suzuki. Barnett already inflicting the punishment on the left arm, on the left shoulder. Greco Roman knuckle lock here. No. Underhooks takes the back to Suzuki. Can he get a suplex on here? Wrist control from Barnett. Barnett switches around, takes the back. Nice reversal from Suzuki. Barnett hooks the legs, preventing a suplex. Abdominal stretch here from Suzuki. No. They go to canvas. Modified crucifix position here. Takes out the arm, does Barnett. Pins the leg. Barnett's going to go to work now on that left foot. On that Achilles, on the heel. Grabbing a handful of face and Barnett slaps him. Not once, not twice. Short forearms from Barnett. 
Oh, body shots from Barnett. Meat hooks to the meat section. Oh, and he's just going back to tenderizing that ankle. Twisting and turning his Barnett. It's a lot of work from Barnett so far, Mike. Yeah, I mean, wow, I've never seen a pro wrestling match here in Japan. This is phenomenal, man. I mean, this, these giant guys are flipping over, and here's... Suzuki going for an arm bar. Can he get it here, the arm bar? Hideki Suzuki, Barnett holding on that vice like Crick. No, Barnett got his, got his elbow out, so it's going to be very, very difficult to do. But Suzuki took some really, really painful leg locks and didn't tap out of them. It was amazing. Oh, can you tap out here? Can you tap out? Barnett, does Barnett get to the ropes, though? And the referee says to Barnett, you have to break. And break he does. Back to centering. The crowd are loving this one, as are we. Barnett has been working hard. His face is burning bright red like a tomato. And Suzuki resets himself. Oh, slap. Just behind the ear and Barnett snorts out a huge gop. Goes for a high left round kick. Outside thigh kicks. And Suzuki tells him to bring it on. You don't want to call forward Josh Barnett. You may as well wave a red curtain in front of a charging bull. All fours now for Suzuki. Barnett front face lock. Up into the genuflect position is Suzuki. Oh, he's neck cranking him right there. I mean, that's very, very painful. He's neck cranking him. Drops down again to one knee. Now Barnett puts him on his back inside control. Going to work on that right arm. And here comes the head and arm choke from Barnett. No, scissor choke from Suzuki. Can Barnett pry it free? Your legs are hooked up momentarily. This is not a position you ever want to be in. Owen Barnett rolls out. Backward somersault. Front face lock now. This is a good spell from Suzuki. Oh, beautiful suplex from Suzuki. And he lands on the back of his head, Barnett. Suzuki takes the back. He's going to try and choke him out now. Look at the pain on the face of Josh Barnett. He's saying to the referee, I'm okay. And Suzuki squeezing like an anaconda. That arm wrapped around the neck of Josh Barnett. Barnett looking for something. He just cracks on the left angle. And now Suzuki incurs the pain. Barnett going to work on that left angle. Look at the strain oh, on the face of Suzuki. That's going to break. I mean, that has got to be a painful. I don't know how Suzuki is surviving this footlock. I mean, Barnett is really putting on some footlocks. He just stumped him in the face. Barnett drags him back to center ring. Puts on a sharpshooter. And Suzuki says, no, I'm not done yet. Barnett just hyperextending that knee. All the pressure, the knee, the hamstring, on the shin, top of the ankle. And look at this position from oh my Barnett. God, with a neck crank. Yeah, he's doing a face, face like neck crank and a foot lock at the same time. I don't know how Suzuki is surviving this. This is Barnett on oh, the top of his wrestling game. And Suzuki cleverly gets the ropes. Barnett forced to break the technique. Barnett stumbles back against the ropes. This high work rate has taken it out of the American. Suzuki looking for a kick here, perhaps. And he does to the outside thigh. Nice work from Suzuki. Barnett returns the favor and drops him. Oh, foot to face. Round kick, knee, and a barrage of strikes from Josh Barnett. Oh, beautifully done from Barnett. Ends up with that arm all locked up. What can Barnett do from here? I mean, he had a chicken wing in there, but obviously Suzuki was very uh, very skilled and escaped out of it. He's now trying an arm lock of his own, and back to the feet, Barnett goes. Barnett goes back I mean, to the ankle. Foot locks, ankle locks are painful, Mike. It's just painful to watch. Look at the hyperextension on the ankle here. And with the shoes on, you know, it just makes it so much, so much easier to do, so much harder to slip out of it. What's interesting here, guys, is that these guys can win by pin, too. But it's th neither of them seems particularly interested in going for that. They're just trying to, to wrench each other's joints out of socket. Well, they're just so active, you know, it's just, it's really difficult to pin them down because neither one of them really stay in one position long enough. They're always looking for escapes and, and Barnett has a pretty solid arm bar here. If he lets go of the leg, he can hook up the arm bar on the left arm of Suzuki. It's really easy here to see the pro wrestling roots of MMA in Japan, incidentally, watching this. There's a, there's a whole lot of crossover. 
in the techniques used. Suzuki is going to try and lift the big man over his head. No. Barnett just lucky. Here he goes. And Barnett on his back. Rolls him over. Can Barnett get the pin now? Only a two count. Suzuki kicks out. That was a great reversal by Barnett. Barnett straight back on top of him. Back to that. Front headlock. Yes. <laughs> hear the heavy breathing of Hideki Suzuki. The referee calls break. A very slow break there from Suzuki. Oh, double drop kick. Nicely done from Suzuki. Gut munching kick though from Barnett. Forearm across the face. And another one. Beautiful elbow to the chin from Suzuki. Oh man, he's showing sweat, sweat all over it. <laughs> and Thompson has got his sweats serving. Barnett drops down onto both knees, takes the back. Nicely done from the American. Oh, nice sit out. He's trying to throw a suplex, but Suzuki was very masterful in defending it. Tried for a rolling arm lock, and Barnett gets an arm lock of his own. They've all been submission attempts so far. Only one pin attempt in the fight. That was by Barnett. Oh, that's a bicep slicer. Oh, that is painful. Barnett is putting some really painful moves. I mean, these are some... This is some dirty grappling here. I mean, that is so painful. You know, you just, your forearm literally crushes oh, your bicep. <laughs> Barnett, now caught in a front headlock. Gets out of it. Looks for the inside thigh kick and finds it. Then goes up to the rib cage. Oh, rolling heel kick! Over the top, took a knee to the midsection. Set up for a ride. No, drops down the back door, does Barnett. And can he take him out of the sleeper hold now? And Barnett find a finish. Just working on the choke. Seems Suzuki like, back up to both feet here. Seems like Suzuki's losing a little steam here. I think he's starting to get a little tired. Oh, Barnett's got him up high. Boom to the canvas. This could be it. One, two. No, only a two count. Two and a half count. Barnett looks at the referee and says it was a three. Ref says only a two. Barnett worked hard for that one. Yeah, that one was that one was a hard slam. I'm surprised Suzuki survived it. Both these guys are moving around a lot of beef, guys. But Suzuki, I mean, he's, he's starting to look... Handful of hair there for Barnett. Referee didn't see it. Misses with the elbow. Uppercut from Suzuki and a crossing elbow to the jugular. Oh, he walked into a knee. Got flattened like a pancake. Referee's going to count him here. So he gets a 10 count here. He if he can't answer the 10 count, this is also a loss. Barnett asking the crowd, saying to him, give him a three count now. Here comes Barnett. What's he got? Grabs hold of a single leg. Barnett setting him up for a ride. Here we go. Suplex! No! Barnett lands awkwardly in an arm attempt here from Suzuki. Can he find a submission? Can he get a hold of that left arm now? Barnett in trouble. And Barnett escapes, takes the back. Good work from Barnett. Never seen Josh Barnett this busy in a fight, Mike. Oh my, I mean, this is this is crazy pace for a heavyweight. You know, they're keeping like featherweight pace. What a Barnett beautiful Bridges. suplex. And still couldn't get the pin. Goes to work on that right wrist of Suzuki. Tries to go for the armbar and loses the position. Now and Suzuki, Suzuki looks for his own armbar. Suzuki is reversing him now. These two men, more subs than a quiz nose. And here's Suzuki with a good shot of the arm. But Barnett rolls out. Takes the back here. Barnett drags him towards the center of the ring, softens him up with a knee to the midsection. Oh, drops him on top of his head. Surely that's it. Barnett hooks the leg. It's over. That had to be it. I mean, he just spiked him right on top of his head. Move that's currently illegal in the mixed martial arts. Josh Barnett gets the victory here over Hideki Suzuki. And he worked hard for it. Both men had their fair shares and finishes of submission attempts. The third pin for Barnett was the successful one. Barnett, who will go back to the US to fight for the Strike Force Heavyweight Grand Prix title in 2012 against Daniel Cormier, is certainly having fun here at Dream New Year's Eve under pro wrestling rules.
Josh Barnett. Showered by the accolades of the fans here. Want to give you a big hello, a big cheerio to CM Punk. Big show. Big fan of all of our shows here on HN. I know that CM Punk is watching New Year's Eve Dream from Saitama. I hope you're enjoying it, Punk. We've got to hook up in 2012, brother. Good sports budget there between Barnett and Suzuki.